But it's a complaint. I have to yeah. take a complaint. You just can't. You can't take mm -hmm. a complaint. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what? So, do you just want me to give them the form and allow them to leave? I can't I can't even make a report of what's going on. Allow us to leave. leave. Well, I got two statements as I'm still being filmed. Roll up on Cheslehurst. I don't really see a need for a um, police station here in Cheslehurst. It's so small. And uh, we're going to check them out. So I walk in here, we got a cool um, Humvee. Calm down up there. Birds are trying to tattle. <laughs> Guard birds at Cheslehurst. It sounds like a horror flick. Hey, look, guys, I got this cool uh, Humvee, uh, original Hummer. It's pretty cool. Look at this thing, guys. Look, they got the window out, so you can kind of look in there. That's pretty cool. It's old, man. And they're not using this thing anymore. Look how old the uh, paper is. It's flapping around in the wind inside there. These birds are going crazy. So they have a couple Dodges and then they have a Ford Black. Is that a trailer? Is that really a trailer? No shit. All right, guys, this is Grandma's trailer. This is where you get your lemon drops and where there's originals. <laughs> Look at this thing, it's a trailer, dude. It's like Cheslehurst written all over it. Look, that's the police department in Cheslehurst. It's a trailer and it's that is big industrial uh, Air conditioning units. Alright guys, look at this. They work four days a week from nine to two. What's that? Five hours? Oh, that means they have like no climbing. Well, dude, it's Cheslehurst. I mean they only need a trailer for the police station. <laughs> I mean I didn't expect much, but I expected more than this. Here's the police department here. Um, they need new siding, so anytime a Cheslehurst police officer calls you for donations, ask them if they're going to fix their building first. So essentially you got the courthouse, you got the police station, and then you got a big warehouse for Probably assuming is the police station. Probably public works maybe. Meow meow, come here. I'm not gonna lock you up. She's probably a stray. There's a lot of stray cats around here. All the woods. That's cool though. There's no collar or anything, probably stray. All right, let's see if this place is open. <laughs> this little guy's funny. We'll go together, come on. You show me where to go. Telephone here.
Nobody's home. Nobody's home. Hold on, let me try this again one more time. There's no dial tone. 6306. We'll try it again. You want to bet it doesn't even work. I know. This is this place is crazy, dude. Yeah, man. There's no uh, dial tone or anything. So when I dial, it doesn't do anything. Should I knock? No. Nah, let's get out of here. Alright, yeah. This place is boring. What a BS town, Chiswick. If you get, if you get murdered in Chiswick, just forget about it, bro. You're not gonna get found. <laughs> yeah, we were looking about getting a complaint form okay. for Chiswick uh, Internal Affairs. Okay. Complaint form. Okay. Uh, we couldn't find a way in, to, uh, an accessible way into the police station. There is no accessible way on the weekend because we're usually out. I'm eating lunch. Okay, so it's, it's that small, so that like. Yeah. Uh, they almost have like no crime. Why is that? Well, I mean, police station is small. Sunday, only one officer eating lunch. Can't really get into the place. Dude, the police department is never open. It's only open Monday through Friday. Police department is only so like if if i listen, listen to what I'm saying. You're not listening to me. Monday through Friday, there's a secretary here. Usually we just patrol. I'm not in charge of doorkeeping. I answer calls, which usually done through 911 or through the phone that is on the side of the building. Do you utilize that? Yeah, it doesn't work. I actually, called 6306. It actually does work. Because people use it all the time. Nobody I, answers. I, I can help you. It's not a problem. Yeah, we just need a complaint form for okay, internal no affairs to take out. No problem. Thank you. Well, you, you want us to wait here? No, you can enter the police department. Okay, thank you, thank you. This cat was keeping us company. Is that your little buddy right there? Straight cat. Yeah, yeah, that's what I figured. Thank you, sir. So what is the, what is it in reference to? Um, a complaint from an officer. On oh, a complaint? What, what is a complaint? I have to yeah. take a complaint. You just can't. You can't take mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what? We're going to take it to our lawyer, yeah, out of the form, and then we'll fax it over to your attorney. Okay, no problem. Or your sergeant. Or... It's not a problem. Look at these chains right here. They're actually not chains, they're handcuffs. Handcuff chains. No, they're just handcuffs. Just handcuffs, then. They're comfortable ones, the well, ones they, that let your right. arms. What is, what is your name? Because this is actually a call for service. Uh, Nine at the central. Show me out at 10 1 with a walk in complaint. No, um. We, we, can't, we can't just get the. I'm going to withhold my name uh, for anonymity. Anonymity. <laughs> but you can record me. Oh, yeah, you're in the service of your. Official capacity, right, right? But I'm also taking for all I know, you're here to do something totally different. Uh, no, I'm just here for a complaint form. You give it to us, we leave. Okay. There's a records identification thing there. And for the public to see. Release. You're not allowed to look at those documents and film those. I'm not, I'm not allowed to look at them, though? You're not allowed to film those documents. Those, not, are, those are work documents. They're not public? They're not for the public to see. They're on display. Right? So this is what they have here if you need to come in and and check out uh, recent TROs. I'm sorry to bother you, sir, on your day off. I have two gentlemen here with cameras in my face and filming everything that we have in this department. Apparently, 
they, they're claiming that they're here to get an IU complaint for a Florida officer. They will not give me their name to take a decent report like we're supposed to. Uh, how should I proceed? Now, you've never known me to exaggerate, have you? Yeah, at least he's asked. They will not tell me their name. I'm sorry? Negative. Negative. They want internal affairs report form, but I thought we had to take it. So do you just want me to give them the form? Because I was taught when I started that we had to take the form and take the complaint. So do you just want me to give them the form and allow them to leave? I can't I can't even make a report of what's going allow on. Allow us to me. leave. Now, okay, they can just turn it into IA Monday through Friday. I actually, there, well, I got two statements as I'm still being filmed. One statement was they were giving it to their lawyer, and the other one was to turn it into IA. So I don't know what, actually, I don't actually know what their process is, but I just want to make sure I'm right in doing what I'm supposed to do, because usually it's not a problem for the officer to take the report and just hand it into the IEA officer, but they don't want to do that, or give me their name. So I'm not trying to breach their civil liberties. If that's what they want to do, take the report, and it's not a problem with the admin doing it that way, then that's how I proceed. All right, thank you, sir. Okay, gentlemen, so kind of a little bit unorthodox for me. Yeah, it's fine. It's like, you know, nobody needs an officer to, like, with a guy with a gun to intimidate them when they're trying to already be, a, they're already a witness, you know? It's almost like witness intimidation. Not, no, we're not think? saying you're intimidating. We're saying that you have a weapon, and that's intimidating. That when, when somebody wants a complaint form, it should be taken with a total compassionate It is double compassion. Act. I have rules that I must follow. Just like I'm trying to make sure right, right. that I don't breach your civil liberties, I have rules that I must follow while so I'm in trouble on Monday morning. Right. Right. I can't even tell you what your name is yeah, to try to explain to my well, supervisor what I was taught to do. So if you notice, I took the time to call. No, you did good. You, you asked. You, yeah, you didn't say, you, here, instead of I'm, assuming. I'm not even involved in whatever you're dealing with. Right. I just have cameras in my face, which makes me uncomfortable as well. It's different, it's but... All, that, that'll, that'll tell you everything you need to know. You can look us up. Or you can look me up. I'll, I'll let him decide so, whether he wants to let you look at what, No, it's not a problem, sir. I'm not even that kind of guy. Yeah. I'm a laid-back guy. I'm just trying to eat my lunch and make it through the shift. No, you're fine, man. Yeah. You're fine. You're good. So, you did, can you did you, everything right. Can you explain to me what New Eating Group actually is, though? Since mm -hmm. I do have this in my hand. We, we are basically, uh, my, it's me. I'm an activist. I go out there and I make sure that cops are doing what they're supposed to do. Okay. That's, that's it. So you Quality randomly, assurance. You randomly picked this spot today? Yes. Or is there something going on? No, you're no, just near us. There, there is something going on. No, you were just near us. So no, we were like, there, all right. There is something going on. They, but it's not here. No, no. Listen to what I'm saying to you. There is something going on. Police stations all over the country are refusing to hand these out like they're supposed to, like the law says they, they're supposed to. Okay. So what we're doing here is we're making sure you guys are doing what you did, the right thing. Oh, that's, okay. that's it. <laughs> well, I, well, you got to realize when I first ask questions, you're a little bit less aggressive than he is in your demeanor. So when I'm trying to ask questions, it's like you're asking me questions. I have to. I'm in the asking and answering question business. It's it's totally right. You're a public the servant. Yeah. If, if somebody comes up to me and like, because I I didn't actually have to well, go the e extra mile. I said, well, let me check and see if those guys. And if you looked at it, you were almost off the. Off yeah. the grid, and I said, "Hey, can I help you?" Yeah. So I'm not a threat no, to no. you or anybody no, else. No, but I do have to ask questions as to yeah. because we were just went through this IA process before with what we're supposed to do as the officer taking it. Usually, folks come Monday through Friday when the secretary's here and the admin's here yeah. and IAB is here. I'm right, neither but, of those. But I'm if, just a if, foot if you look at the website for the New Jersey State Attorney General, no, I get it. I you should it. actually um, have them in a bin. Available for somebody to walk right out, grab it. Right. No questions asked because when an officer comes up and says, "All right, now no. who's the complaint on oh, no, no, this?" No. It's intimidation, well, and then I'm not intimidated. What I'm telling you is, we were instructed 
to not turn people away and to also take the report and then make sure we get it to where it goes. I don't have to read it. I don't have to agree with it. I'm supposed to take it because right, you right. could say, I never gave you the paper. Right. I have no, I have no report. I have no way to even log that I had two visitors. What do I say? A white male and a black male enterprise? No, I understand it. See, that's one of the so, reasons we have documentation. Well, same, you, same have it, I, you have it, but you I really don't have look, it. Look behind you. you do. I understand what I'm telling you, sir. <laughs> I can't just pass out things anonymously and not ask questions. Yeah. That, no, no, no. We expect I have, you I have to make no, sure, yeah, yeah. You're allowed to ask. I have to make sure you're okay. Yeah. You know, you didn't give me a chance in my head. You don't know why I'm asking. Maybe it's something that I can forward to my supervisor and say, hey, gentlemen came in and they felt like they were mistreated by a shift. I don't know who it may be, but you look into it and then I leave because we get in trouble for not passing information on properly. Right. We're, we're all so challenged. So I get that you're doing civil liberties, but I'm the first guy who to look out for civil liberties. Yeah. I was yeah. just going to ask questions because I'm 42 and I... Uh, you, you have the right to ask, but just remember that we have the right to decline politely. Okay, yeah, so yeah we, 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 we're not trying to like actually... Um, okay, do you, and, it's fine. We can step outside. Do you need anything else? Oh, no, no. actually, no. Yeah, we, okay. we're not trying to agitate. We're just trying to, to... Have you ever heard of First Amendment auditing at all? No, sir, I'm not. I'm not uh, aware of that. But I don't worry about auditing because I always expect people to limit rights. Yeah, you did. I, I, you, and did and you, and you did, and you asked. Exactly you did a good job. I mean, you did a good job. You, did a good job. you weren't sure. You asked, you know, and then you found out, you know, that you could give us the form. Most right, cops. Because you, usually, are you guys coming to see me? No, ma'am. But I'm a pet lover, so if I see one, where you guys live at? Um, I live on 135 Cleveland Avenue. Oh. Okay, ladies, I'm sorry about your dog. If I see it, I'll either try to get it or I'll call you and let you know. And if we get it and we trap it and put it over here and hold it, I'll just bring you up here so you can get it. Okay, thank you. All right, ladies, have a good day. Um, you'd, be how many, you'd be surprised how many officers are not as educated as you on this subject. That just think that they already knew the law so they don't have to call anybody. But you said, hey, look, what is, what is the process here? I know it's a small department like Chiselhurst. You don't get a lot of people coming through here asking for a complaint form. Well, technically, what usually happens is I force stated my experience. Yeah. I can't speak for any other officer, but usually folks come in Monday through Friday. Yeah. Usually don't have a random, like, it was even weird to me not to see a car out here. That's why I started right, walking right. around the building. Yeah. Because I also, you know, take precautions to make sure I'm safe during the course of the day. So to make sure you guys had what you wanted. I also right. called you back to make sure, because, I mean, there's some folks that... No, I mean, I totally understand that. You know, you don't know what's going on. You want to find out. So, yeah, we yeah, totally I, understand. And I don't want you to mistake me being aggressive in my duties. I'm going to ask questions. That's just who I am. Right, right, right. You know, we know that. Uh, yeah. you, you popped up real quick, like, yo, this... Nah, I'm not trying to breach your... What I'm trying to make sure is when you get your paperwork, yeah. when my bosses ask me on Monday, on my day off... Right. Because I'm going to get a call on my day off. If something goes wrong on the weekend... Yeah. You get a call, hey man, because it's a small department. Hey, what happened on? Because uh, I have no other partner that you can ask. Yeah, me. right. My partner's off today. Right. So it would be me. So in order to be able to answer effectively, I have to go ahead and say, hey, you know, is everything okay? You guys feel safe? Is something going on in the town? Because the chief's going to ask. He's right. going to come straight to me and say, uh, no, we understand he's that. Gonna but skip rank. He's going to yeah. come. There's no buts for me. I have to have enough information. Just, just, just I wanted to shake your hand and say thank you for your service. You did, you did a good service for your department today, and you made them look good. Uh, I appreciate it, man. Yeah, you did good. You did good. Overall, you did good. I mean, the excessive question, invasive questions. It's not invasive. I'm not going to keep going on with you. Right. Thank you, sir. Have a good day. All right. Thanks, He's man. Back up. I get it. Everybody's got one or two. <laughs> Now he's, now he's going to follow us. No, he's not. He's going back in. So what do you think? Is this a, a pass or a fail? I don't know. I think it's a fail. I think it's a fail mostly because um, he didn't know. And he instead of, he assumed the... the, the well, event. the way he was talking on the phone. Oh, and they still have their cameras in my face. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. He failed. Yeah, yeah. That guy. <laughs> he was trying to get us marked up. But, you know. But we got it. 